Okay, so tonight for supper, I am going to just start it up a little bit early. i got some ground beef in here with a little bit of salt. I'm going to add some pepper. Uh, I've got my niece with me tonight, so I'm not going to really put too many spices in there because she doesn't like a lot of it. Uh, typically, I would put like onions and vegetables in with my ground beef and then put a layer of cream corn and then the potatoes. But uh, I won't be adding any vegetables or, or onions or anything like that because she doesn't like that. But I will, I'll just like add some veggies to the side so I'm gonna make a shepherd's pie um, I'm gonna go get my potatoes ready over there to be cut cut those up boil those and then just get everything prepared and then at around 4 or 4 30 I'll be able just to pop it in the oven and it'll be cooked for supper so I'm gonna go get this going and I'll show you guys when it's ready to go into the oven all right so my shepherd's pie is out of the oven I just kind of went down and kind of separated it into three and then I'll make them, so basically there's going to be six big pieces of shepherd's pie. I'm trying to do this with my left hand here. So I'm going to go serve the kids and I'll show you guys when it's plated. Alright, so there you go, shepherd's pie. Now usually I would put ketchup in when my hamburger is mixing up and I completely forgot. So it's a little on the dry side just because um, it wasn't cream corn that I had, it was like corn pieces but um we'll eat it up anyways so that is tonight's dinner